And with Hollywood's sex abuse scandal growing by the day, hundreds rallied in Los Angeles today to raise awareness. The Me Too campaign encourages victims who have kept their secret struggles silent to speak out. Here's CBS News correspondent Mireya Villarreal. Along the famous Hollywood Walk of Fame, hundreds met to take the Me Too movement from social media to the Starline streets. Every step I take is to make a better world for her. Nearly a month ago, the hashtag Me Too lit up Facebook and Twitter. March organizer Brenda Gutierrez, a sexual assault survivor herself, was motivated to help the victims. I'm definitely hoping that people leave here and be like, okay, I'm not alone. I have, there's like all these other people that I can reach out to now. A flood of accusations against Hollywood heavy hitters like Harvey Weinstein, Kevin Spacey, and Louis C.K. acted as a catalyst for more people to come forward. Saturday night, some of the industry's most recognizable actors used the red carpet to show their support. It doesn't matter if you're a man or a woman, if you live in Australia, or if you're in entertainment, it doesn't matter who you are. As a humanist, this is something we need to get rid of. It's despicable and it needs to stop. Rise up for the women of the world, for the women of the world, rise up. Me Too is a grassroots project that started in New York more than a decade ago. Overnight, Me Too blew up because of issues in Hollywood, but this is bigger than Hollywood. Way bigger than Hollywood. It's way, it's an epidemic. It's a worldwide epidemic. Founder Tarana Burke is a victim of multiple sexual assaults. This day is kind of emotional. It feels, I've never imagined a time where people would stand together in the street and say out loud that we survived this thing and we stand together. So it feels really special, really important, and the start of something new, a new way for us to do this work. Stop the violence, stop the rape. Mireya Villarreal, CBS News, Hollywood.